Here's another one of my uh, Windows 8 compatibility videos. This is a fairly new game, Saint Rose, Saints Rove the Fourth. Uh, I did have to uh, go in here and make some adjustments and everything to allow it to play. Uh, you saw right there there was some vertical tears. So eventually, I went back in here and got rid of the uh, turned VSync back on. So then it ran fine. Uh, difficulty, I just choose whatever you want here, and you can uh, play your game. Now here's a couple. Uh, pieces of the intro and everything. I have the sound turned off because of the whole music thing. Uh, later on here, I'll be turn, the, turn it back on. I'm just going to eliminate the music. But you can see uh, this is a uh, intro screen and it runs perfectly fine. There's no real action going on here. It's just playing the video. So uh, we'll skip through uh, this real quick and take a look at that actual real game action. So here's the end of the video uh, intro where it's just, uh, you know, there's no real interaction by you. So uh, as soon as we get done, it puts us in our uh, particular situation. And you'll see we're now firing and we're actually doing things. I'm going to go ahead, like I said, I'm going to turn off the audio, uh, at least the music down, so we don't get any music copyright infringement stuff. So you can hear some of the game action. And get back to the game. And here we go, taking a look at the game. So you'll see here that everything runs smoothly. There's no rips, no tears. Uh, I did have to turn V-Sync on, like I mentioned earlier, uh, get it to run uh, perfectly fine. But you'll see that there's a very nice, even game play here. No problems whatsoever under Windows 8. Now here to jump to a quick fog. You can see the fog there and how nicely it uh, ran. Uh, again, I'm on a GTX 580 on NVIDIA card. Uh, beautiful graphics, nice, smooth uh, action. Uh, now we're in a larger world. Instead of being in the interior, you can see how it renders in the world. Uh, no slowdowns, no nothing. So be not afraid. Go ahead. If you're thinking about upgrading to Windows 8 uh, and you have uh, St. Rose 4, like all newer games, of course, they're going to run on the newer versions of Windows. By the way, this is Windows 8.1 now, uh, and it runs uh, perfect. So enjoy and uh, have fun uh, uh, playing St. Rose 4. And don't forget to subscribe to Old Guy Geek. We have over 150 Windows, Windows 8, and Windows Phone 8 videos, and we're publishing more all the time.